we're getting a break uh, from the stormy weather, at least for now. Take a look at the temperature trend over the last several days. Big difference. Uh, last Wednesday, it was almost 70. We dropped over 20 degrees lower than that yesterday, down to 46. It might be even colder than that today. In fact, it very likely will, which would be no big surprise considering what it feels like right now. It's 31 in Salt Lake just below freezing. It's 21 currently in Park City, mid 20s in Vernal, mid 30s in Green River, just a little bit above that in St. George, or it's currently 33 degrees. Otherwise, it looks good out there. We've got a few straight clouds over the mountains. Aside from that, fair skies, which is part of why temperature dropped so low. We didn't have any cloud cover to give us any insulation. Now, high pressure continues to build in from the west. Uh, that will keep it dry for another couple of days and gradually be warming us up. But at the same time, there's enough cold air trapped in the valleys. We're getting some inversions developing, and that means decreasing air quality. So it's going to be looking a little hazy out there today and tomorrow, but it won't last very long because the next storm moves in on Thursday, Thanksgiving Day. That'll break up the inversion, scour out any pollution that's building. Initially, that'll bring valley rain and mountain snow, but it gets cold enough Thursday night into Friday morning that we might even get some snow all the way down to the valley floors in northern Utah with the possibility of heavy snow in the mountains. Looks like this storm could stick around a little longer than that one we had over the weekend and behind it we're expecting the coldest air so far this season even today we're still going to be running a little bit below average for this time of year we're only forecasting 44 in salt lake city but it will be a sunny day so you get to spend some time in the sunshine that'll hopefully take the edge off most valleys will range from uh, the mid 40s to mid 50s warmer in st george near 60 close to that on wednesday and thanksgiving getting cooler heading into the weekend in fact uh, hovering near 50 on saturday and sunday with morning temperatures this weekend dropping all all the way into the mid to upper 20s and in Salt Lake City partly cloudy a little warmer tomorrow mid 40s on Thanksgiving but a good chance of rain by the afternoon and evening which again could change to snow by Friday morning we will dry out over the weekend but it gets colder afternoon temperatures will be in the mid to upper 30s with morning temperatures by then dropping all the way down near the 20 degree mark